Is your financial advisor working in your best interest? You'd think the answer should be yes, right? In reality, it's more like maybe because some of the retirement advice you've been getting might just be suitable for you while also making your advisors richer too. But all that changes now as the fiduciary duty rule finally goes into effect. Under this new regulation issued by the Department of Labor, it raises the bar on the level of advice you'll be getting for your retirement investments. Meaning before this rule went into effect, your advisors may have recommended financial products that are pretty good Good for you, but come with higher fees or commissions that benefit them. In a 2015 White House report, the Council of Economic Advisors estimated that this conflict of interest costs investors $17 billion every year. Now with the fiduciary standard in place, brokers have to be more upfront and recommend retirement products in their clients' best interests. With these higher standards, consumers like you and me will be paying lower fees, saving money we can be enjoying in retirement. For the financial services industry, it could cost them billions in lost commissions and added compliance costs. So it's no surprise that some firms have been against the rule, even though many have been preparing for some of the changes it will bring once it goes into effect. In fact, the fiduciary duty rule was supposed to go into effect in April, but President Trump backed the directive to delay the rule and review it again. His administration said they fear this rule will reduce Americans' access to certain retirement offerings, information, and advice. But after careful consideration, Labor Secretary Alexander Acosta confirmed that the rule would be phased in beginning June 9th. Even with this in place, it's important to continue to ask your advisors questions like, are you acting as a fiduciary while advising me on my retirement accounts? And what exactly am I paying for with a breakdown of all the fees? If you get a response that's defensive or unprofessional in any way, take your money and move on.